Page is uh, international uh, recruitment officer. I don't know if your title is exactly that, but I think that's what you do. <laughs> <laughs> From Assiniboine Community College located in Brandon, Manitoba. So um, Page has a, a presentation uh, ready for us. And um, as mentioned before, uh, we're going to be uh, conducting the webinar in English, and I'll be here to help out with the interpreting. So uh, I'll be here. So anyways, Paige, please welcome. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you very much for that awesome welcome, and thank you, everybody, for being here today. Um, I'm going to start off with a short video uh, about our college, and then I'll jump into my presentation. Uh, feel free to type questions throughout, and at the end of the presentation, I will go through all of your questions, and hopefully we can get everything answered if I don't answer it already during the presentation. Um, so I'm going to just turn off my sound, and I'll play that first video for you. Welcome to Assiniboine Community College. We are a top choice for post-secondary education in Manitoba, and we are proud to welcome students from every corner of the province, from across Canada, and from around the world to our college community. With many certificates, diploma, and postgraduate programs, we have something for everyone at ACC. Our instructors combine classroom theory with hands-on learning inside labs, kitchens, shops, fields, and the college's sustainable greenhouse. That includes our renowned culinary arts and hospitality programs, where you will be working in a state-of-the-art kitchen, learning from top chefs. At the esteemed Manitoba Institute of Culinary Arts, you will be cooking with locally grown ingredients, fresh from right next door. Our new greenhouse brings together three different solar-powered, energy-efficient grow solutions, alongside an outdoor grow plot and teaching orchard and it would also be your classroom for courses in our renowned and expanding agriculture and the environment programs. Perhaps you'd like to learn a trade, for example as a mechanic. You will be learning in our Len Evans Center for Trades and Technology, a large modern open concept environment that is home to eight different construction and mechanical trades programs. Both those buildings are perched on our North Hill campus in Brandon, overlooking the scenic river valley below. We also have our Victoria Avenue East Campus in Brandon, where we offer full training labs for our nursing and healthcare programs, where you can combine your caring personality with career-ready skills. Just down the hall are our dynamic business administration programs, which will open doors to an exciting and challenging career, with seven specializations to choose from. You could also tour our modern computer and audio video studios, where our technology and media students harness their creativity across a wide range of digital environments, from communications to animation to network administration. Elsewhere in the province, ACC also has a Parkland campus in Dauphin, just renovated with $3.5 million in upgrades to increase our carpentry, healthcare, childhood education, and business training. With more than 10,000 full and part-time students every year, our sought-after program still maintains small class sizes and leave plenty of professor time for each student. Our programs are designed to help students move seamlessly into their careers. ACC graduates who enter the workforce have an enviable 93% employment rate within nine months of graduation. You will love it in Manitoba, a great place to learn about Canada. We boast four distinct seasons and are one of the sunniest spots in the nation. Our prairie landscape is surprisingly varied, there are even ski hills, and we have unforgettable skies. With more than 100,000 lakes in the province, many of them in nearby provincial and national parks, there's no shortage of outdoor recreational activities when you're not studying. There are also cultural attractions, from museums and art galleries, to music festivals and sports, from baseball and curling to, of course, hockey. And you can't go wrong watching the ACC Cougars. With soccer, futsal and volleyball, as well as Western Shield gold medalists in women's hockey, there's always something to celebrate at ACC. So come, join the Cougars and the rest of Assiniboine Community College in friendly Manitoba. My name is Paige Janin. I am the international coordinator, uh, but I do look after all of our international student recruitment. 
So a little bit about Manitoba. Lots of students, they're very excited. They want to come to Canada. It is a wonderful place here. Um, and Manitoba is located kind of right in the center. Uh, and Brandon, uh, we are kind of the heart um, of Canada, as we like to call it. So we're right in the middle there. Brandon is our main campus. Um, so we have two campuses there. But we also have our other campuses in Dauphin, um, which is about an hour north, um, and then Winnipeg, which is our main city. So as I mentioned, we have our beautiful campuses. Um, these are all of our Brandon campuses. Uh, so up on the North Hill, um, as you saw from the video, we have our Len Evans Center for Trades and Technology. Brand new building, um, only a few years old with every bell and whistle um, for the best educational experience. And this is a historic building. Um, it used to be an old hospital that the college has purchased and converted. It was built in 1923, I believe. Absolutely gorgeous. This is home to our culinary arts programs, hotel and restaurant management. And then our main campus on Victoria Avenue East. This is where our international offices are located, as well as all of our business programs, our media programs, healthcare aid, um, any of our other human services like early childhood education. Um, I'll talk a little bit more about the programs as we go along, but we have amazing campuses um, and there's lots of great things for students to do outside the classroom on our campuses as well. If you're interested, uh, we do have virtual tours available of all of the campuses. Um, and so you can sit at home and have a cup of coffee and check that out on your own time. They are awesome um, and they're constantly getting new upgrades and changes and we're doing lots of renovations. So all of the classrooms are getting um, all sorts of new technology all the time. So with COVID-19, um, there's a lot of questions, but we are an approved designated learning institution. Um, so on October 20th, the government posted a big list. We were one of the first schools approved on that list. Um, so we do have a readiness plan that's available on our website, and it shows how we're going to support our students um, that are going to be coming during COVID-19 to Manitoba. We are still doing in-person classes um, or blended classes. So you will need to travel to Canada and to Manitoba um, and we will support you along the way to make sure you have all the documents and letters and things like that, that you will need um, to be considered essential travel during COVID-19. So we get a lot of questions. Um, what's the difference between a college and a university? College in the US is a little bit different than college in Canada. The biggest differences are going to be that hands-on learning experience. So when you come to a college, um, our motto is learn by doing. You really get to practice the things that you're going to be doing in your career. So when you go to a university, you're going to listen to lectures and you're going to have all sorts of assignments and tests and you're going to have that too, but you're also going to get to apply the theory that you learned in the classroom. Um, it is a little bit more structured, so you will go to school every day, uh, Monday to Friday, and depending on when your practicums or your lab times are, uh, but generally you'll go to school from you know 9 a.m. till 4.30 p.m. Um, and have that the whole day. Our programs are shorter in length, so they are um, one to two years. We have one year certificates, uh, two year diplomas, but all of our programs do qualify for post-graduation work permits, um, so there is an option for that. And as I mentioned, you're gonna receive not necessarily a degree like a bachelor's or a master's, but you'll um, have that certificate or a diploma. So neither institution is better than the other. Um, it's just depending on what, what it is you wanna do for a career and what type of education um, best suits your learning style. Uh, the one thing with our graduates um, is we do see very, very high rates of our graduates finding jobs within uh, six to nine months following graduation, uh, many even sooner. Last year, um, I think these might be a year out, but we had 92% last year, I think, of our graduates that had a job within six months after graduation with that average of $40,000 a year Canadian salary. Um, and 88% of our students did stay in Manitoba. So if immigration is something that you're interested in, uh, coming to Assiniboine and coming to Manitoba is a great option for that. As I said before, um, learn by doing is our motto and it's exactly um, what, it, what it says there is you get to practice those skills. Um, our culinary arts students, we have a restaurant on our campus that they will cook for. Our hotel and restaurant management students will 
run the restaurant. Our sustainable food systems uh, classes will grow the food that the culinary arts students use to cook. Um, our broadcasting students, we have a TV station, we have a radio station. Um, they're able to actually practice those skills. All of our healthcare aid students um, get time in our clinics, in our um, home care system, able to actually do what they're going to be doing in their career. So what can you study? I mentioned this briefly. So we have one year certificates. They are eight months in length, maybe nine, um, but they are considered one academic year for the purpose of the post-graduation work permit. We have two-year diploma programs. Some of these programs may have an exit option where after the first year you can um, take your study permit, uh, or sorry, your um, certificate instead of getting the full diploma and then apply for a job then. And then we have a postgraduate advanced diploma. So if you already have a bachelor's degree or a diploma from your home country and you want to build on that education, um, we have eight different postgraduate advanced diploma programs. And then we have our English for academic purposes. So this is um, a thir or 14 week program. Uh, you can take up to three terms of the program. So three 14 week um, sections and each section is designed to bump your English level up uh, 0.5 of an IELTS score. Um, I'll talk a little bit more about that later. So the first step is to choose your program. Um, if you're not sure what's quite right for you, you can always email us, but you can always reach out to Great Start and they can help you um, see what programs are available. Um, we do have all of our programs available on our website and it's always kept up to date. We added our January 2022 programs this week. Um, so that is all ready for you. Once you've decided on a program, uh, you can fill out our online application form. So Great Start can assist you in making sure that you have all of your um, documents in order, everything you're going to need to apply. Um, so there is an online application that can help you fill out it is still that $200 application fee. Uh, you will need your official transcripts and they must include an English translation. For your application, we do accept um, electronic copies, but you will need to bring the official ones with you to Canada um, to show us when you arrive. And then uh, the competitive entry programs will have additional requirements. Then once you, if you meet the admission requirements and there's a seat available, you will receive your a letter of acceptance of which then you can use that to apply for your study permit um, and then hopefully we'll see you on campus shortly after that. And I would encourage you all to follow us on Facebook. We do have lots of um, great things that we post every week. Um, we posted about Ramadan, we have our Tasty Tuesdays, so every Tuesday um, we post different recipes from students from all over the world, um, so I'd encourage you to check us out on Facebook.